In the late 1920s, three progressive and influential patrons of the arts, Miss Lily P. Bliss, Mrs. Cornelius J. Sullivan, and Mrs. John D. Rockefeller Jr., perceived a need to challenge the conservative policies of the traditional museums and to establish an institution devoted exclusively to modern art. They, along with additional original trustees, created the Museum of Modern Art in 1929. The works displayed on this floor roughly span the years 1880 and 1940. Within an overall chronological flow, galleries highlight individual stylistic movements, artists and themes, including Cubism, the work of Henry Matisse and Vincent van Gogh's The Starry Night, among other subjects. The rich and varied collection of the Museum of Modern Art constitutes one of the most comprehensive and panoramic views into modern art. From an initial gift of eight prints and one drawing, the Museum of Modern Art's collection has grown to include over 150,000 paintings, sculptures, drawings, prints, photographs, architectural models and drawings, and design objects.
At the end of the visit, we enjoyed a nice lunch at the Terrace 5 Café, located adjacent to the painting and sculpture galleries. <laughs>